Hey everyone, what's going on? We got a package in the mail today. It's exciting. So for those of you that don't know, I'm doing a Kickstarter right now, and I think there's about 10 days left at the time of me filming this. Um, and I got kind of the final version of the circuit boards for that Kickstarter. Sorry, the camera's moving around so much. So it's um, it's like a USB hub for the Raspberry Pi Zero, these awesome new tiny computers. They're really cool. So actually, this is the second version. I have made, this is the first version right here that does work, but I added some, took away some things, added some things, made it more complete. Anyways, I'm gonna assemble one right now, and then uh, I'll show you it, see, show you how it works, and maybe you wanna go to the Kickstarter and buy one. I also made a Kickstarter video, you can go and check it out. Anyways, let's get to it. Got the solder paste on, now let's start putting components on so we can stick it in the oven and bake it. It's called reflowing. Okay, it's now uh, ready to be reflowed in the oven, so I'll go grab the oven. And by the way, the chip that I'm using on this is called an FE1.1S. It's a really easy to use USB controller, and uh, it's just simple and it works. It has all the built-in voltage regulators and things like that. So if you plan on doing your own or using my design, which is available on GitHub by the way, so you don't have to get on a Kickstarter, you can build your own. but it's uh yeah it's it's great they're good chips i forget what i was gonna say anyways let's reflow this and then keep going <laughs> All right, it looks good. A few bridges as expected, but no tombstoning of the caps or resistors. That's when they stand up like that. And uh, yeah, nothing we can't fix by hand. All right, so it's finished. Where is it? Oh, here it is. All uh, soldered up, got the USBs on. So let's take our Raspberry Pi, plug it all in, and see if it works. I think that's a good idea. Give it power before and make sure no magic smoke comes out or else it won't work and nothing gets hot. It's not going to do anything because it's just a USB hub. So now there's power running through it. Okay, let's plug it into the Pi. Alright, there we go. Snaps in pretty easily. Alright, that lets you plug in your HDMI. Let's say Wi Fi. Ooh, these new USB ports are nice and stiff. It's sitting right there. It's powered on. Let's see the monitor here. And there we go. Should I don't. No. Yep. It's working. 
So you can see the LEDs. Tell you which USB is plugged in. Which is cool. We got the Wi-Fi working now. And there you have it. Mouse is working. Keyboard is working. And we got Wi-Fi. I think. Yes, we are connected. So it's working out. And the great thing about this is it's such a simplistic design. There's only one component. There's no soldering to the board. And yeah, it's uh it's called the Pi Angle for a reason. So like I said, I'm doing a Kickstarter for it. If you want to help me uh help me out and back it, that'd be great. You're welcome to go to my GitHub page. Uh, there'll be a link below, probably somewhere in the video. And you can, uh, if you're familiar with surface mount soldering or ordering circuit boards, you don't have to buy one straight from the Kickstarter, but if you want to support me for doing these open source projects, that would be great too. Uh, there's a hack a day page where you can upvote this for some Pi Zero prize or whatever like that. And, uh, yeah, it's great. Everything works. So, you know, plug and play USB Pi Zero Hub, the Pi Angle. And if you check it out, I got another Pi running right here. That's my Kickstarter amount right now. I'm trying to get to 5,000, but see if we do it. Hope we do. Tell your friends. Tell everyone, people that don't even know about it, maybe they're, they'll get into it, who knows. That's what the Pi Zero is for, $5 computer. I'm just gonna play some Minecraft here and uh, with my Pi Angle and my Pi Zero. And everyone, that's how you build it? Well, not really. It's pretty easy. Pi Angle, Kickstarter, be good, have a good night. It's been a while.